Yeah, you know, the gold one, it breaks too much. It and always you know, does break too much. That's why you always need the diamond, the diamond hose. And there's no diamond hose left out here, Bill. That's the crazy part. There's only gold hose. Good for the I, moment. I and they definitely don't understand that. I played some Minecraft in my day. I love why Minecraft. We can, wait, wait, wait. You play Minecraft, Bill. No! Why are you vaping? Stop! Stop! What are you doing? Bill, you bro, need God put this here for me. You throw that device away. God put this here for me to enjoy. No, we didn't. A company did. A simple one. Oh, damn. I'm sorry, Bill. No, you, you, you didn't you let don't me need it. Weed. I mean, I was on here earlier and you. No. You disrespected me. Get out. Uh, the Charles Zero, there is no Andrew K here. Okay, that center is not on this hotline. Hi. Hi, Hi there. Welcome to the Christianity Hotline. How what are brings you? brings you on to the hotline Bill? today? <laughs> How are you? I'm doing really good. How about yourself? I'm doing pretty well. No, she just went through a breakup. Yeah, I did. Oh, really? Yeah. I I'm not doing too well, but I'm sorry. People seem to be, like, really mean to you. I don't here. care. Are you sure? Uh, I'm sure. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Why are you vaping? It's not no. vaping. It's an inhaler. No, it is a vape. I know it is a vape. No, how do you know that, though? Because you, I can see you smoking it. No, it's an It is a vape device with no. nicotine in no, it. No, it's an inhaler. No, it's not. Yes, it is. I no, it's not. Show me Why would I show lie to you? Why would I lie to you? I can see it. No, yes. you can't. Yes, I can't. <laughs> I trusted you. I, I trusted you, and you you you, you broke no. my heart. No, Bill. You, please. you broke I'm sorry. You my heart, I'm and I don't think you can ever put the pieces no, back Bill. together. Bill, I'm so sorry, Bill. I'm sorry. You know how it feels to me. I understand. You don't I understand. care about my feelings. I, I care about your feelings. No, you, you made do. me really sad. I'm so sorry, Bill. No, no. Nothing's gonna ever fix what just happened. We're gonna go take in our next caller. So if you would like to become a Christian, make sure you say guest to Bill. All right, I, I see a few sinners in here saying guess me, Bill, like I'm gonna guess you. No. Uh, Chuck, you, I'm, I, I would never fake my feelings. All right, we're taking in our next caller. So if you would like to become a Christian, make sure you say guess me, Bill, right now. We're calling in your local nut job into the Christianity hotline. Hello. Hi. Hi, Bill. Welcome to the Christianity Hotline. My name is Bill Jensen. What brings you uh, onto the Christianity Hotline today? So I am on to the Christianity Hotline because I want to repent. You want to repent for your sin? Yeah. What I did do. you do? Bill. But it's bootylicious. Wait a minute. What what is bootylicious? No, Bill, remember me? I'm bootylicious. I dyed my hair. See? I got tracked. I now. see that you dyed your hair, yes. Now I don't remember you. Oh my god. Like, Bill! So there's like a major issue here, Bill. This is the thing. This is why I want to repent. What's going on? <laughs> Why? What is it? My ass. Why <laughs> are you showing me your beauty? I think God cursed me. No, no maybe. Is, is that like surgery? <laughs> Wait, somebody in the chat said surgery. Is that like <laughs> <plastic laughs> surgery? Stop. <laughs> what is that? What is that? No! Don't do that! 
I'm sorry, Bill. My bad. Bro. Now, real I'm bad. asking you, is that plastic surgery? Yeah, it's bot. Why did you do, do that to yourself? Oh, uh, see? So here's the thing, Bill. Uh, I'm at, why did, why did you put free? fake stuff on you? Kylie Jenner said that they would do it for the free, so I did it. That just sounds like a bunch of bull crap. It sounds like you're bull editing crap. yourself because bull you can't crap. naturally you make it. Now, I don't want to see no more fake booty, okay? Stop. Like, oh my God. I don't want to see $50,000 in fake. No. So, I, I want you to get rid of your plastic surgery. Go natural. Bill, you know what? It's okay, Bill. No. It's okay, it's Bill. It's not okay. Be like that then. I'm asking you to help me repent. And you're over here being mean to me. I'm not being and I don't mean. mean. I'm telling you to stop you doing plastic surgery. I am I literally just stopped. This is why I'm here. I'm here to talk to you so you can, like, deliver me out of this curse. Like. I mean, you did it to yourself. And I know. No, but I'm just trying to, like, you know, I need your prayers. All right. I will pray for you, okay? All right. Could you pray for me right now? Dear God, please help this woman out so that she can find herself back to the light and become a natural woman again. She might have sinned and she might have done things wrong, but I know if you give her another chance, she will make the right outcome. Amen. How do you feel? I feel amazing. Thank you, Bill. No problem. You have yourself a great day. No, no, you do not do that. You don't do that on the Christian hotline. Do you understand? You don't do that. All right, you don't, you don't go up on here and try and show your booty. I didn't want to see that. Uh, Connor, a simple woman with a fake booty, came on here and, and started to sin. Chuck T. Farley, your numbers are way down. That's because I don't care about the viewer count, unlike you. Like, do you not realize I have been doing this for five years now? Do you think I care about a view count? I do not care about a view count! Now, anyways, we're going to go take in our next caller. So if you would like to join in and become a Christian, make sure you say guest to Bill. Hello there, Jay Sean. How are you doing? Hello. Hi, Billy. Uh, my name is Bill, but uh, that's okay. Welcome to the I Christianity would... Hotline. Okay, I would really like to uh, confess my sins because I believe they've been weighing on me for too long, and I feel like I picked the right person to confess them to. Okay, well, you have come to the right place, and um, please tell me what you've done. Okay. So, the other day, I was driving in my car, right? And, okay. I, you know, I got to the crosswalk, and there was this mom, you know, she's walking with her baby, and, I don't know, all of a sudden, the devil just took over me, and... I don't know what, t like, possessed me to do it, but I, like, ran them over on the crosswalk, and now, like, the cops are after me, so I have to hide out, and I was wondering if I could come stay for you, from you, like, with you. So I, like, feel super bad about it, and, um, you know, it's just been weighing on me for, like, a little bit, but I feel like they low-key deserved it, though. Like, if you really think about it. So what are you trying to tell me? Is that you want me to help you out and do illegal crimes? 
Yeah. Pretty much. I don't want to do that! Why I'm not? not? Like, I need help. I need to be no. saved. No, Please. you're a criminal! No. You Please, are like, a criminal and you're going to hell! They might have deserved it. You don't know. No, they didn't. Nobody deserves that. They might, like, that. they might have deserved it. Like, you don't know what they've done. No, I don't know. You are, a, you are disgusting. No. That's You're dis plain disgusting. Next caller. She ran, apparently she ran two people over. That's what she did. Hello. Hi, Hi Bill. Hello. Hello there. Welcome to the Christianity Hotline. What brings you on here today? I see all these people are being rude and being sinners. I don't like that. I don't either. I never have. Pardon? I don't like, like it either. I know. It's not. I don't think it's very nice of them. Like, it kind of hurts my feelings. It's okay. Don't worry about Don't worry about that. So how was your day, Bill? Uh, my day has been pretty good. I just started up the hotline, and um, I wanted to go and uh, take in some good callers. That's my day. I want to ask you a very, very important question. Like, oh, yeah, sure. I've what been always... I've always been on your lives and stuff, and I always see I've been following you for so long, and I was just wondering if you want to be my husband or my boyfriend. Well, uh, I, I just love you, Bill. Why do you ask that? Me and the Christ. Because I just, you show me compassion. You show this life so much love, and I just love it. I appreciate it. And it makes me so happy. That Thank you. So is that Thank you. Yeah? Uh, now, I don't know you. I don't know how old you are. But you seem like a what great person. What did you person. get to know me? Uh, I don't know. Maybe. I think I really think you should be my husband. I think I, I, should, I should see some ID. Um, okay. Hold up. Hold on. Oh, she wants to tell you something. Hold on. Tell him something. Oh, she's a little bit shy. That's okay. No? Uh. So, do you like kids? Uh, do, do I ever want to have kids? Yeah. Do you want to have kids? I do want to have kids. Uh, two, particularly three. Yeah, you want to have three? I do. I do want to have three kids someday. Yes, let's pray. Pray. All right. Now, if you would like to, if you, you show me some, yeah, show let's me your ID in the DMs and uh, hit me up. Let's just pray. Let's just pray. I come in peace. Let's just pray. Dear God, please Dear bless God. every single person that is in that room right now so that they can have a great life ahead of them. Now, I don't know if this, this woman could be my wife, but I still can respect her and wish nothing but the best for her. Amen. Amen. Now, thank you. I love you, Bill. Very, very can kind you of you. you love oh, no. I'm so sorry. I didn't. I didn't mean to. I I didn't mean to do that. I didn't mean to. Oh, so that was. You see that? No. No, you know people are saying you're young. You're a liar. I just seen it. No, I, I took you out for a reason. Hello. Hi, Bob. There. Welcome to the Christianity Hotline. What brings Hi, you here you today? So, a couple of years ago, actually, I was on with you uh, when you were a bit larger than you are now. Honestly, I'm really proud of your little weight loss journey. Oh my god, I look clapped as fuck at with it. Sorry about my language. Wait, wait um, I didn't. Uh, wait, what'd you say? What language? I. So I, I accidentally swore uh, devil's words, and I'm, I apologize for that. Um. 
so basically a couple of years ago I came on and you tried to convert me to Christianity because I live in the UK uh, oh my, sorry my iPad you is said it off, again no. I'm, I'm really sorry it's because I it's because I'm British it's literally a part of our like language our vocabulary we swear quite a lot um and we also have a timer for every hour of the day where we drink tea. Okay. Okay. Well, that's yeah. really cool. Yeah. Um, you also messaged me um, asking me to be your girlfriend. I'm 18 now, so I can actually say yes to that. You're a girl? Wait, you're, you're 18? Yeah. You want to be my girlfriend? I took, you asked me to be your girlfriend. Uh, you asked me to be your girlfriend a couple of years ago, um, but I was under age then i was 15 but i'm 18 I now must have been, i must have been i think 16 a couple years oh well, yeah I thought, yeah I, was 17, I thought you were 17. well yeah. you're not um, my dms i will hit up your dms right. but just don't tell my boyfriend <laughs> bro she is she's 14 or 15 no i'm 18 All right. are you okay, okay. Look stop, talking, stop talking to my comments no Sorry, you look very, very concerned. Are you okay? Huh? Are you okay? You look very concerned. I do look concerned because you, you have a boyfriend. I, I know, but I can easily get rid of him. You're for the I would happily get rid of him for you. I don't, listen, I don't want to get cancelled. But I can say good luck Why? to you. Why no. do you not want to get cancelled? Uh uh, because I, I, I want to say something so stupid, but I know I won't do it. Um, you have, I, I really want to know what you have to say. Message me. No, it, it's going gonna, it's gonna to stay in my head. I'm, I really, I'm, I'm keeping it here. Why, why do I really want to know? Also, Bill. I, I, guess, I guess it's a mystery. Well, I have a question anyway. Um, about Because obviously you convert people and stuff. Yeah, I do. Um, so basically... Uh, when I used to live in America, um, we actually met up, and you got me pregnant, and obviously I've had to get rid of this baby that we what? had. So, I yeah, you don't know you. you. Yes, you do. I do. don't know you. No, I never you... had sex with you. I don't know you. I have never had sexual intercourse with anybody. Then why was I pregnant when the DNA test came back saying that it was your what? baby? Listen, you might have been with a bunch of guys, but I've been with no women. So you stop this. I'm so sorry, Bill, I never but I just want to be... I never put my pay in the butt. I never put my pay pay in the JJ. I'm a good man. I'm a good woman. I mean, I'm eating an Easter egg. Body I'm count. Um, I'm a, my body count is one. Ah! That's disgusting! Are you I'm kidding me? I am literally a Christian. I'm eating an Easter egg. No, you had pre-marriage intercourse. That is a sin. Oh, no, I am married. Me, my, me and my... Get yeah. out. I'm tired of your games. I'm really tired of your games. I'm not playing them. All right? I'm not playing them. Don't play with me. Now we're going to go take in our next caller. So if you would like to become a Christian right now, make sure you say guess the bill. Uh, Fambo, I, didn't, I don't even think I know that woman. I thought maybe when I was like 16 or 17, I might have been like, you're, you know, you're pretty. But, but then she said stuff about the pregnancy. I'm like, I never even met you. Oh, uh, no, no, I, should, no I, I, don't, I shouldn't date Justin Bieber. Why would you even say that? All right, we're calling in uh, Oliver into the Christianity Hotline. Yo, Bill. Hello there. Hey, welcome to the Christianity Hotline. My name is Bill Jensen. What brings you on to the Christianity Hotline today? I want to be converted, bro. I ain't going to lie. How long have you wanted to become a Christian for? 
Ever since I saw you, bro. I, I just I just knew you had to be the one to convert what me. What I need you It's an honor. To right now, Cole, is I need you to close your eyes. Fold your okay. hands and repeat after me. Okay. Dear God. Dear God. I have finally come to the conclusion. I have finally come to the conclusion. That I want to become the one and only true religion. Wait, wait, wait. Before I say that, can I say something? What? What? <laughs> wait, wait, wait. <laughs> what? Why are you looking at me like that, bro? I'm waiting for what you were about to say. <laughs> you, no, you asked the question. I, what <laughs> is it? <laughs> you look like Chris. <laughs> You look like Chris Griffin, bro. You look like the skeleton from Minecraft. You look like the skeleton from Minecraft, bro. You look like Chris Griffin. <laughs> Do the thug shaker, bro. Do the thug shaker. Do the thug shaker. Thank you. <laughs> do it. I don't want to do it. Wait, wait, so Bill, is your name Shane Boyle? No. Are you acting? Not Shane Boyle. My name is Bill Jen. <laughs> but he, didn't he, he, he went live. You think my he went live on your Chris time. Griffin too. <laughs> you you slimmed down. I'm sorry. It, that was very disrespectful and rude of me. Like, shut up. I have oh, made a severe. I'm trying to act like you're so tough. I'm tired of. I have, I have made a severe and continuous lapse in my judgment, and for that, I'm sorry. You should burn in hell for that, man. You're, you annoy me. Get out of here, bro. Shut you the fuck. Shut man. I'll What are you gonna do? Alright, um, there's no reason to be on here. There's women lying to me. There's people calling me Chris Griffin. And I'm just getting nothing but, but disrespect. So since I'm getting disrespected like this, I think I'm gonna go switch this over to Twitch. Um, if you all would like to join in and join in on the Twitch stream, my, my name on Twitch is live with Bill Jensen. Uh, I will be live on here tomorrow, so don't forget to go check it out tomorrow at the hotline. Everyone go on Twitch and look up live with Bill Jensen. I will see you all tomorrow. God bless.